Learning more about Amy Carlson, the woman known as Mother God, whose mummified body was found last week in a home used by the religious cult Love Has Won. Seven people have been arrested. They are facing charges related to abuse of a corpse and child abuse. Two children were also present inside that home near Crestone. Investigator Rick Sounder talked face to face with two members who have now been released from jail. After a week in jail, Ryan Kramer and Karen Raymond left free on personal recognizance bonds. Just before that, Kramer gave us a statement we recorded on audio. God is a woman. And that's uh, Amy? That's correct. Hey. Let everyone know. That's all I have to say. God is a woman and this whole planet will know. You will all know what is happening. Pleasure. The mummified body of their leader, Amy Carlson, they call Mother God, was found in this home near Crestone. She had been ill for some time. In YouTube videos, Kramer earlier talked about Carlson's illness. Why can't she heal herself? She's God. Well, that's a great question because God can do that. Why doesn't she heal herself? I actually don't know how to answer that question. Before leaving jail, I asked Kramer, how did she die? I, I actually do not have an answer for that. Sincerely, I don't know. In the home where Love Has One was living, Carlson's body was found decorated like a shrine. With Christmas lights and no glitter. Okay. Is she going to be reincarnated? You tell me. God is a woman. <laughs> That's the divine truth. But I want to make sure I understand. God is a woman yes. and Amy is the God? Yes. She's been reincarnated many, many times. 534. Yeah. This is her 534 life. Yeah. So maybe she'll come back to life. That, maybe she'll come off a starship. With their leader dead, one member turning on them, and others still in jail, at this point, it is not clear that love has won. In Southern Colorado, Rick Salinger, covering Colorado First.